Hello guys, my name is Hafo and uh, today I've got a Sony Vegas tutorial for you guys and it's just, hopefully I'll try and get it done quickly because I'm a bit, don't feel great again. And uh, basically it's how to uh, synchronize your shots with your music. It's really, really, really easy. Just may take a while to explain as I'm not too great at explaining it. Uh, so basically we're just going to want to drag in our clip. As you can see, here's mine. My quad feed again, which I'm using again because I don't want to give all my other clips away and basically I'm just going to drag through this clip find where my gunshots are didn't mean to do that uh, that's the ma that's one of the things you have to do just drag through find where your gunshot is press S keep going again drag through this is so you can like when you're synchronizing it up to the music you will know uh, where the shots are so then you can find where the beats are and basically just drag them together and make them make them one Okay, there we go. So I found all my gunshots this far. That's really easy that bit. It's probably the easiest. Well, there's no. It's all really easy. So I, uh, I often see montages that don't have this synchronizing, and I just think that they could be so much better if they had it. Now I'm going to drag in my song, and uh, yeah, this is also an easy bit. I tried, I know where the chorus is roughly, so I kind of dragged it over there. My clip over there. And, uh. Okay, so what we're going to want to do is, we're going to want to find where, like, we want the gunshots to go. So, like, there might be a certain beat or a certain, like, a, a bit, like a drop, a music drop. I don't, I don't know, there might be something that you want to synchronize your shots to. And the bits you want to sync your shots to, you just want to play through the song. And just push M on your keyboard wherever that there's like a beat or a, a lyric or I don't know, whatever. So I'm just going to quickly press M on mine now. Just find where the uh, the beats are and uh, yeah, wait there a sec. The reason, oh that's done by the way. The reason I like this song is because all the beats are fairly similar length apart. Well they are. And uh, yeah, it makes it a lot easier for editing too. So what we're going to want to do is, as you can see, here's my first beat. What I'm going to do is just literally drag this clip. This is the first section of the clip where the first gunshot is. And you're just going to drag that over to the uh, marker there. Really easy. That that was already synced to the first shot. As you can see, it scopes in. There's the shot. And there's the beat. Then we're going to drag over our second part. And that'll just be the second part with the second shot but as you can see this time it doesn't reach to the uh, marker so what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to hold control and then drag it outwards and that'll put bring it like slow motion but but it'll still link up it'll still um, synchronize the shot and it looks just as good then we're going to do the same with this one drag it outwards slow motion and then with this one I think we're just going to have to shorten it a bit bring up the speed and uh, yeah, that 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 is it. That is synced now. And uh, basically, I'm just gonna drag in my gunshot sounds. Oh, uh, if you want the downloads to these, I got loads of them. I mean, you can easily find them online, or you can make your own. I mean, I don't know. Or if you want me to give mine, just let me know. But yeah, that is pretty much perfect. I mean, it's really, really easy to do. I mean. It's just a simple thing that makes everything look so much better in like a video. Um, if you found this useful, which I hope you did, please leave me a like, it really helps. And thank you so much for 300 subs.